but we're gonna be jumping into game one here blacklist international going against fire flux who can be the winner of the first round of group c of these two teams we can already see i kind of wanted to see you are right here we have that lunox into the roam position the barats into the exp and it does look like we see a little bit of an evade tig might be in a little bit of trouble here yeah but uh, on the red buff there uh. is some information trying to get by tigreal and uh, he sneak up on lunox but gets uh, his Flicker uh, baited out immediately and double buff Akai goes to probably help the mid lane but gets uh, like quite a small amount of damage going to the river minion going to farm it and uh, oh yes no ah. no 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 not enough but a good try good try yeah I would uh, wanted to credit the second skill of Ruby here absolutely like concealing the first skill of Akai didn't even connect so wow that was such a great reaction Akai tried to in my opinion go for a Ruby kill there but was uh, denied it was denied we do see a little bit of a final slash happen ruby come in the daytona welcomed connects st st stuns two against the wall for blacklist international we do see the retry come out though rose able to secure a kill onto haji and tinzi able to kill sensu there edward diving in deep trying to get tinzi they're able to you able to secure the kill the passive by nana's proc but by flux not opting to go for it yeah, but a uh, good uh, impact from Lunox there, full, uh, full light ultimate and the Edward gets picked up on top of that, being greedy with the trying to go for the lane and farm some more minions instead of going to the base, lose some minions but not feeding, eventually he is going to lose a lot of minions but they saw it earlier i mean todak played with uh, lunox jungle so i guess at least saw the lunox jungle and the initiation on the akai here gonna force to use his heavy spin defensively just to purify himself and run away out of this and uh, going back to the jungle straight away but the uh, double ultimates are traded and that's pretty good i mean fire flux is pressuring but the gold advantage is not that high only 1.5k and the heavy spin is going out trying to spin out the barats here barats didn't proc his own ultimate yet but used the flicker and the, Ooh, the glacier super and i'm offended people and the, but is it enough damage though low hp everyone just uh, running around flicker used to run away by arlos trying to clean up carry uh, trying to clean up all of the kills and uh, successfully doing it three people dead gonna go straight for the turtle or no lord no i think no, they don't want to go without it. look at that glacier freeze paired with the i'm offended there by apex 47 and the tinsy just following up just massive amounts of damage from fireflux as well as look rosa coming in from the right flank to stop that escape Fireflux on fire at this point. Blacklist International being put onto the back foot. Uh, the winning factor that Blacklist International has. Now, Fireflux, they just got to keep this pressure up, you know, utilizing that I'm, a, I'm offended, baiting out those heavy spins and stopping it. Edward getting caught by the Tatonos. Welcome straight into all of Fireflux there. The heavy spin to kind of zone them out to hopefully save Edward's life. The five and slash comes out. Rosa, though, able to take out Edward. We do see a little bit of an implosion here as no. ooh, Apex or uh, Apex to secure the kill onto you now gonna allow them to zone out blacklist international and take that mid turret yeah and uh, Tigreal was trying to cc here the lunox uh, successfully did it but no follow-up absolutely not and the uh, black ultimate going in and almost killing him uh, zoning out of the turret and the wow the three what three turrets gonna fall now now blacklist they're they're trying to fight back you see what they're doing here a little bit of a play flicker and an implosion Ooh. coming in not having to utilize that heavy spin just yet but fireflox fighting back oheb taking the turret we do see oh, the you course. able to and secure the, the kill on the alien i'm telling you she just brings that damage for barbie uh, Lord here for Fireflux, but it's too early to make a call. And the ultimate is going in. They're going oh. in from the Lord. Burst 
what is it? <laughs> but the retribution of the Akai jumped in and steal the Lord. Two people down, three people down from Fire Flax Impunity and the counter attack from the Fire Flax carry going in, but the tanky build is not doing as much, but it's going to be enough. Sunshine! The mo movement speed is insane. They're gonna finish him off? Maybe. No ultimate on Nana, though. Nobody is oh! going to counter, but the low, low damage, so low. The tanky build, but uh, yeah, finish off the Arlot, but the... Aurora is dead I, on the other hand. I don't know if, if was it worth it. It was crazy. I mean, we can kind of look at this. Haji trying to utilize the implosion before he l dies. But Sunshine not letting up on the pressure as Edward utilizes that final slash cut. But right here, swoops both of them in. Able to secure the kill on the Rosa. Trying to close it and... Uh... Eventually, might to go to the turret here. Heavy Spinner going on to the Barazzo, who could use his own ultimate on the uh, opposite team, but didn't result him surviving. Yeah, coming into this mid game, my suspect is that Blacklist is now kind of countering a lot of that magic damage. But Sunshine left all alone. Retri does come out onto him, but Apex able to slow him down. Sunshine all alone. Uh, Blacklist International wants to take Draw. him down. You able to secure that unstoppable and take out Sunshine on Fire Flux. It, I mean, it was it's... definitely running into a little bit of a problem. He's, I, I think it com it's coming down to the Sunshine's being majorly aggressive. But he, now he, like, he, like, he didn't kill him and die, so I, I don't understand. Ooh, I like the play there by Sensu. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, he utilized that retreat to zone out Rosa, keeping them at bay, does reset him back. They're trying to utilize this Lord to crack into Fire Flux's base. Still clearing up uh, the tier two turret there. The Lord is now coming in. It is an enhanced Lord, so it's going to crash into that tower. What is Blacklist going to do? They're kind of playing a little bit passive. Mm -hmm. yeah, Maybe opting to go for Rosa. <laughs> yeah, the yeah, there it is. The heavy spin coming in, looking for Rosa. Nothing, though. A Daytona's welcome Ooh. onto you. The passive proc. Is he going to be able to escape the flicker out? <laughs> <laughs> wow 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 such a good initiation but such a good like defense uh play here and uh look at this fight here yeah look at this lunox like insanely good assassination on the uh, nana here which no passive because of the last uh, time and double immortality proc one of them killed second time and that's gonna secure the lord for fire flux blacklist international gonna have to mount up a great defense here Alien for looking for a little bit of a cheeky play. Lord crashing down. All towers being pressured. Fireflux, what are you going to do here? I am offended on the Sinsu. None yet. A final slash and an implosion on four. Five of Fireflux with a blazing duet into the back line of Fireflux. Fireflux now on the retreat as Blacklist Internet applying heavy pressure three have fallen four have fallen Ooh. it's all up to sunshine at this point what no a play minutes. by blacklist international giving it up to haji that implosion was nasty uh. securing four deaths on a fire flux sunshine left all alone the molina blitz to be able to secure oh, the kill man. you blacklist international going to push in this final tower and it looks like they're gonna win the game here war barbie oh man that's insanely huge like but I, wow. just, just just the second just the second i wait I, I i just i just thought like what are you waiting guys like i mean <laughs> i mean pressure the enemy attack somehow like at least some damage and uh, and then they didn't and they immediately get a huge counter attack